Hey everybody, uh, Glenn here. I'm doing a inspirational video. Um, I'm getting ready to butcher some some chickens. I guess that's not too inspirational for them, <laughs> but um, <clears throat> had a little bit of time here. I guess we'll call this inspiration from the butcher table, butcher block, or whatever. But uh, yeah. Anyways, um, where today's verse is is found at is um, Ephesians three twelve. Um, this is a verse that I think a lot of people imagine there's a lot of controversy but uh, I felt this is what I was supposed to to uh, share so here it goes it's Ephesians 3 12 because of Christ and our faith in him we can now come boldly to the throne of God and into his presence um, I guess some Bibles will say it, you know, uh, differently, like the King James Version says it a little bit different. Um, this is the New Living Translation. Um, I do, I do like the, um, the uh, King James Version, it's just sometimes I get lost in the these and the thous. But, uh something there that was that's said we can come boldly to to God we can come into his presence we don't have to go a roundabout way to get to him to speak with him to have a relationship with him um we can come boldly knowing he is our father and uh we can ask him for anything. Um, you know, it's sometimes kind of forget that, that he is our father. And a, a father that loves his children always, you know, he wants to see them succeed. He wants to see them taken care of. Um, God knows what's best for us. So we might not always get exactly what we wish for or what we want because God knows that's not always best for us. But we can come boldly to Him and ask. He wants us to ask. Um, we don't have to be ashamed or of anything we've ever done. He's forgiven us and we are His children and we can just come to Him. Lord, I'm having a problem. Father, I've, I've messed up. Whatever. Um, but we can come boldly to Him and ask Him whatever it is that we are asking for. Um, it's not, you know, I think sometimes we get a little confused on that. We, we can know, we can come into his presence and just ask, I feel like I'm just rambling here, but I'm hoping that I get something out of it. Um, I forget that sometimes, I guess, that we... He does love us, no matter what we've done or where we've been, what we're going through. He loves us, and He knows what's best for us. He's not going to do something that's going to harm us. Um, well, I guess that's enough rambling. Um, I feel like I am, but I hope uh, you can remember this, that you don't have to be ashamed to go to him you don't have to do 
certain things, acts and stuff, to go to him, we can just come boldly to his throne. And um, he'll meet us there. He'll meet us there. He loves us. So, well, I hope somebody got something out of this. Um, yeah. So I guess till next time, just go boldly to his throne. And uh, God bless.